Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Man the Maker. Welcome back to another episode of Old World where <laughs> I'm feeling desperate. <laughs> Let's end the turn and see what happens. Um, yeah. These barbarians are freaking aggressive and they're making it really hard for me to... Uh... Did they actually kill them? Wow, they did actually kill them. And another raid comes from the north. Um, somebody of Borsaba has died. In battle? Or just, uh, no, I don't think so. Um, news of Prince Kador. We've got, uh, it turned out to be wise. Excellent. Plus one wisdom. I guess we take it. Uh, King, yeah, the victims of the bear attack are delivered safely to the settlement of their nation. And he likes us. Plus 20 opinion. Do you like us? You, your opinion is plus 20. Express a desire. Offer to set up trade between our two nations. Food for money? Hell yes. That is freaking amazing. Uh, meanwhile, yeah, let's, let's beat you down. So you're now gone. I'm gonna take a swing out of you. They've got a uh, Huskarl coming down, Jesus Christ. I will definitely need to heal you up, won't I? <laughs> I will definitely need to heal you up, won't I? You can just sleep. I'm, I'm basically never going to do anything with you. You need to kind of run away. You can sleep. Okay, we actually have six orders left over. Perhaps... Um, not the Duke. I, I don't know. Oh, it's you. Tutor. Let's try and get some tutoring in there. And let's try and talk to the Danes. Tribal marriage? I can marry them. I think we need to do this. I'm actually afraid that we need to just marry them and get them off our back. So that way we can deal with the problems in the south as well as just like actually improve our cities once more because we're just not right now. Um, we are just not improving our cities at all. Get the heck out of there. Right, my builders are asleep. Okay, at least you're finally connected, right? That's good. Um, we, okay, we're, we're working on the Oracle, but that's not enough. That is not enough. They continue to land more troops. Continue to push on us. I'm ill. People are converting to Zoroastrianism. We've lost the discipline, so we've lost even more money. Ring the bells. We are now married to the Danes. Roderick here does give us a little bit of additional uh, discipline, which is really, really nice. King Roderick, I could divorce you. I'm not going to do that. <sighs> I'm not sure what we're going to do about you. You're going to kick this guy's ass. Okay, she's actually leveled up, which is nice. Um, the Charisma. No. I think we're just going to go for Shield Bearer with you. You can just go here and repair. Just do it right away. And you start moving in this direction while healing. Healing. 
And we're gonna move up here and start to clear y'all out. I don't have the orders, but I can buy one quite happily. Hey Danes. You're not even pleased. Um, I'm gonna sell a bunch of this. Boop. So at least we don't run out of money. And Mari, you've got uh, you, well, you finished your walls. Okay, that's something. Um, and I think we're just gonna go for a treasury, actually. I mean, a rancher wouldn't be bad for the additional things, but. I'm also pretty worried about our money. A fiery ride! We invited Amari to participate in its grand celebration honoring the goddess of the hunt. Riders will race along a treacherous path in the dark of the night, passing torches. This is the city's first such competition, and they would like you to attend as a guest of honor. Nice, because we got a culture event. Um, I can spend money. I will, I will bet on the frog face, even though I'm super broke. Okay, we lost. If only I had ridden myself. Becomes equestrian. New mounted units plus 100. Interesting. And he's completed a study of politics. Orator or judge? Um, orator. I need money. So it's a judge that we're going to be. I, the rest of it I don't care about. But this gives us a little bit more discipline. Um, sorry, the judge gives us a little bit more discipline. Which I think is really important. Right now. So we stop bleeding cash like crazy. All right, let's end the year. Let's see what they what what they what they do to us. <laughs> they take their way with us. Well, they just keep coming in the north. This is very very aggressive. Somebody died. I'm not ill anymore. That's great. Our son is the head of the Chaldean family. That's probably good. And Axemen. Anti-polearm also with cleave. I mean, we do have horses. And actually, that there's a lot of planes out here. It's def That's definitely what we're going for. Um, you want me to build a barracks? I want you to do that down here. Where has my workers... Oh, the workers gone here. Um, well, we can't really deal with that right now. You murder this guy. Murder this one. And put more hits on this one. It really is a road through here. But uh, that's going to have to wait. And uh, yeah, you're definitely coming back here and starting to throw up some barracks. As soon as you can. And you've got nothing to do. you got nothing to do. A message from your heir, Nadintu, paints a vivid picture of her tactics training. Is she our heir? Are you our heir? Yeah, I guess she is one of. Surviving to fortresses, surviving in forests, learning to use the wild. Survival skills or learn how to exploit weaknesses. Survivor skills. Commander. Cool. Commanders are nice. Emphasizing the importance of strengthening Babylonia, the Amorites oppose a marriage with your son, Prince Kadur Anil the Romantic. I don't want... I, I want... I need more money, unfortunately. I will do the money thing. Let's keep moving in that way. Recently, you've been thinking about improving relations with Prince or with our son. Uh, I can see some profit. Start the mission. I'm too busy for that at the moment. Oh, he's upset with us. Judge of our schemer. That's just not going to happen. Shining is you and the governor of Balon. We have leveled up again. And this could give us quite a bit of minus discontent, which we're going to definitely take. Because this stuff gets out of control super fast. Having it at only plus four right now is fantastic, actually. Um, I would like to influence them, but I need orders for that. 
and money <laughs> which you know we don't have anything like that so okay looks like this raid has finally been dealt with unfortunately these are both gonna fail i just don't see us actually doing it um, which is unfortunate because it does give you additional orders basically wow they do a lot of damage pyramids are done we've got extra discipline on our prince that's fantastic uh, we are severely ill, and we have a grandson. That's really bad. Holy crap. Um, that came out of nowhere. War is broken out between the Vandals and the Greeks. Conflict's on their doorstep. We side with civilization against the barbarous Vandals, for sure. And now we're at war with them. Officially. Uh, you want us to give you some luxuries... And they're going to give us a court thing? No, we'll keep our luxuries for the time being, I think. A new merchant? I'll take a merchant. You can have gems. And I get a court merchant. Minus five per year? Yeah. Who comes? Orestes. Not actually giving me money, though. <laughs> so, that's kind of unfortunate. I was, I was hoping he would actually help with the money, and you're really not doing that many great things for me. Uh, you're going to come here, and you're going to add a general. Hammurabi, huh? Um, yep. Welcome aboard, buddy. You take a slap at him, please. And now... You're not going to be able to kill. Or you can kill. So we're going to weaken. We're going to weaken. And we're going to kill. And just like that, we're out of orders again. <laughs> Um, I do kind of wish I had added a general. If we die, we don't get this. Oh, man. <sighs> Severely ill we are, huh? You stay where you are. The minor is complete. And yeah, that did give us the luxury. That's that's pretty interesting. Pretty nice. Um, we have no stone. Hearing the damage, kind of whatever. I think I'm going to get a worker here, because I think I need more workers, desperately. Um, I know I said... No, we're doing it. We're going to come here. It's time. We're going to put a barracks in. I know you can't do anything. I know you can't do anything. I'm sorry. But the borders are finally defended. We are at war with these guys now, so that's probably not going to stay that way. Um, probably not. And another group lands, even. That's okay. Attack the city, and we are going to die, which is too bad. A tribal raid from the Vandals. We're converting to Zoroastrianism. That's fine. Um, arrival amongst our best generals. Two generals approach. Focus on the left flank, we have to pick one of them. But as the danger and watches your lead. Hmm. Focus on the left flank, go on the right. I mean, I could let this happen. Go to the right first. I don't know. That's fine. I don't really care. Um, commerce, because we are broke. Buddy boy. <laughs> now we're not broke. Harvest festival. So the Danes have invited us to attend a harvest festival. Um, we are definitely going to... You know, we can't do that. We're going to stick close and improve on uh, improving relations. Plus 40 opinion. Tribal peace? Tribal peace? We need an ambassador. Which we can do. Which we can do. 
I can deal with the tribal opinion. Wow, I just want a religion opinion? <laughs> 50 foreign opinion? I don't want to make any of them generals. He's severely ill, are you? Is that why I can't make you a general? Indeed. Well, I'm gonna do this. So we complete a freaking ambition, thank you. And we're known as the Drill Master. And we've leveled up with additional courage. We've got some a heckler. Better against generals, better if damaged. Kind of like the tough. Whew. Wow. We've actually managed. To put a stop to this. I do need an ambassador. Minus 20 religion opinion is kind of crazy. But I guess it's you. Pop. Tribal peace. Please do it. Please, if we can stop the raids from here, we can just turn all of our attention to the south. Which is what I'm going to... I mean, right now, I'm just going <laughs> to focus on building stuff. You, my friend. We have no stone. Yeah, I, that's actually true. Um, so just come here and make me a lumber mill. Um, stone gets a bonus next to volcanoes. Get me more quarries. I think that this is a real big problem that we've got to fix. We can promote, can you fierce? Steadfast versus tribal, I mean, this is our situation right now, right? You stay put. You can go back to sleep. <sighs> Production in Babylon. Seems like we can take a moment to breathe. Can we actually build any of these things or do we need technology? We need technology. Indeed. We can spread our religion. Do you get a minus because of Zoroastrianism? Indeed you do. It also just takes growth, which we have a lot of citizens. You know what? I'm putting my citizens there. Let's let's get some more orders. <laughs> Desperately in need of. Um, and actually, I'm going to make another worker. I, I think we've secured our northern border. Now we just need to defend the south. And I think I'm going to turn an inward eye temporarily. I'm going to get a lot of workers just building stuff. And I'm going to try and not move around. You, of course, arrive from somewhere. Enact philosophy is now a legacy. We've died. We have died in office. Indeed, the general died, but we got we got the legacy, so that's fine. More people are converting to Zoroastrianism, and they like us more from that. That's fantastic. Our uncle also died. They just both died at the same time. Um, fortunately, we've already started our... King Kudur wasn't the, the queen? Wasn't my sister the heir? Only if there's no son? Okay. Yep, we lost a merchant who died. Alright. Or XP. And there's a coronation. Access except granite to build stele. Equip an elite guard. Ebony to study them. Kill them and take everything. Wait, who is this from? If it is, they only give their gifts, they will be using great royal works. Carving with laws. <laughs> Kill them and take everything. 
<laughs> um, I feel like that's gonna do bad things. Uh, we're not so into that. I mean, he is a warrior, right? No, he's a judge. Judge it is. And then we've got refugees from the Danes. We can fight them or let them come. And let the Danes come. We will be... What? How the hell did that happen? Why? What? Okay, I seem to have undone it. Let them come, we'll be ready? I don't know what just happened. <laughs> okay, a poor elderly farmer comes to court, bearing a blade of unusual metal covered in exotic designs. He discovered it in a deep network of caverns, and he believes it would make it a worthy gift for Euler. Accept the sword and give gifts to the farmer. What are we? I mean, we're a judge. Accept the sword and give it to him, yeah. Of course. Mysterious sword owner. Okay. We can choose a new governor. It can be me, though I think I would... No, I'm a judge. Yeah, it should be me. Definitely me. And you want me to capture two foreign cities, control three siege units, or control four woodcutter specialists? It's a lot of specialists. We don't even have siege units, and I can't see us capturing foreign cities. I can't see us doing that. Ah, maybe eventually. I don't know. This one seems the most likely, I guess. Now, I, I don't understand. We're not at war. We're not at war. Well, I'm going to move y'all south and start promoting stuff. Uh, tracker, I love. Additional mo uh, vision. We're going to reposition these guys and consider... I mean, I'm just going to even promote you. Horsebane, Herbalist, Bloodthirsty. That seems good. Continue fighting this Huskarl. Can't, uh... Okay. Seems like you were not able to move. Very well. Um, and we've got another soldier here. Which, uh, I guess he's okay to stay where he... Uh, he has to stay where he is. And it's the end of an era. Long live King Kadur Anil the New. XP. We grieve... We did want the access to the Stella. I, I don't understand this. If they wish to fight, then we will fight. War with the Danes. Let the Danes come. War with the Danes. I mean, I don't really want to deal with the tribal invasion. Is this for real? I have no choice. I was just married to y'all. Only minus 11. I mean, this peace event. I I'm supposed to end the episode now, but... <laughs> I guess we're going to. Okay, uh... 
I, I don't know. I don't know which one we're going to do here. I mean, I would love the extra legitimacy. And in fact, I'm just going to take it for that. Boop. Plus 10 legitimacy. Tribal invasion with the Danes. They don't hate us nearly as much. Maybe we can even just make peace. I mean, I don't know what she's going to do when she gets there. Hi, everyone. Um, you know, uh, our king is your leader. And uh, the lovely queen sent me here to formalize and make peace. We're at war, you say. They're both dead. The king and the queen are both dead. I'm dead, you say. I see. Well, thank you very much. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Until next time, my name is Man the Maker. Take care, everybody. Have a wonderful day.